Hello and welcome to this Tonic Impact Portfolio Tool version 2.1 demo. The Impact Portfolio Tool is an Excel-based tool that Tonic has created to support its members who have committed to deploy 100% of their capital into impact investments. The tool enables investors to classify every investment in their portfolio according to the intended impact and see um, what are the interplays between asset classes um, as well as other financial variables and also to keep track of the impact performances of the investments. The tool also generates a set of charts that are helpful in analyzing your portfolio in time. So let's take a look at the tool and we will focus on version 2.1. Um, here you can see the initial disclaimer page. It's version 2.1 and it was last edited on June 2nd, 2018. It has a Creative Commons license that enables users to build on this tool plus um, uh, sharing, sharing it publicly, um, but not for commercial purposes. You can read more about the 4.0 Creative Commons license if you would like to make changes to this tool. Let's start with the reference guide. This is the um, impact framework that Tonic members use to map their investments to the sustainable development goals. Tonic members use a set of impact themes which have been co-created by members of Tonic to map their investments to the sustainable development goals. You can see the themes in this column. There, are, there is also a set of outcomes that are uh, referenced and uh, inspired by the targets that the United Nations have set for each of the Sustainable Development Goals. And you can see the numbering that inspires each of the outcomes. Let's take a look at the Portfolio Template tab. The first two columns are about the asset classes and sub-asset classes. You can find here asset classes commonly found in a portfolio of investments plus philanthropy which is strategic, uh, strategic for many impact investors. And the way you can use the tool is by start entering the name of each investment in these columns here, column C. So we start with an investment for a common investment fund within cash and equivalents among the portfolio of tonic members. I, I will start with microvest. short duration fund. This is a debt investment that has a liquidity profile lower than 30 days. So tonic members often consider it as an equivalent in cash. There is a second column for security identifier. You can find a legend here. This is not a listed investment, so I will just enter NA. And let's start categorizing, but it Let's start categorizing this investment by its intended impact. You can find the legend here of the categories that Tonic is using, thematic, sustainable, responsible, and non-impact. These are industry-widely um, known categories, originally um, published by Bridges Ventures. Um, and there is a description of each of them. I will start labeling Macrobest is a thematic investment. Uh, so an investment that aims to create additional positive impact in a specific impact theme. Thematic, primary SDG, I will label it as no poverty. And the impact theme will be financial inclusion. There are a few more columns for the impact geography. And this is a global fund. Expected average long-term returns. This is the individual expectation of an investor, ex-ante. I, I might say 2.5% expected return. And the financial return profile. This is inspired to Omidia Network um, capital, uh, spectrum of capital returns that goes from full capital loss to extraordinary returns. I will label it as commercial return investment. 
investment vehicle. This is a fund, financial instrument, fund units, liquidity profile, less than 30 days. And there is also an impact expectation rating. You can see a legend here. And it refers to a scale from marginal to catalytic impact. And there are guidelines on how to classify them. Uh, since MacroVest does a very good work in measuring output and outcomes, I will label it as substantial impact. But again, this is a subjective evaluation. And I might enter here a market value for this investment. This is the first tab. There is another tab, the impact management tab. And as you can see, these are the two tabs that are highlighted in green because these are the only input tab in the tool. So we'll go to the impact management tab. And this is meant to report and keep track of the impact at portfolio level. So we see here within cash and equivalents, macro best short duration. And we can start by uh, categorizing the outcome of this investment. This is part of SDG number one, and the United Nations set for um, goal number one as a, a set of targets, targets to be reached by year 2030. One of them is to increase number of individuals with access to basic services, including banking. I will choose this one. And there are a set of output metrics which are uh, um, which leverage the ARIS framework, the version 4.0. There are a few that we have mapped for uh, sustainable development goal number one, and they are relevant to financial inclusion. So, for example, the value of loans receivable, the gross value of loans receivable the value of loans fully repaid on time. Um, how many client individuals have been providing new access? And, you know, a few more. I might choose this one, for example, based on the reporting of MicroVest. There is a definition of the metric. And I can enter the measurement. I don't know the exact number of individuals with, who were provided new access to banking services in 2017 by MicroVest. I will just assume it was 100,000 people. And so on, all the impact metrics can be entered. The tool also generates a set of charts describing the, the, the portfolio, the visually described portfolio. So far, we have only entered one investment in cash and equivalents. So as you can see, that's the only bar that is generated. But for the sake of showing you this tool, I have, um, I want to, I want to show you a pre-fill tool. This is for KLF, uh, KL Felicitas portfolio, KL Felicitas foundation portfolio, which is public and you can learn more about, uh, it's amazing history and it's, uh, both financial and impact performance um, measurement in the past 10 years or so. And you can see investments across all asset classes. There is a market value and, and a calculation of the percentage of the investment. And I want to show you the chart. So there are these pivot tables and if you enable macros when you download the tool, the pivot table will automatically refresh and the charts will generate it right away. There is this one just about the primary SDG the portfolio, an asset pie chart, and much more. So you can use this tool to generate a set of very interesting charts for your portfolio to keep track of it to report its impact metrics. And it's a valuable tool for all the investors who are building a 100% impact portfolio or also integrating impact uh, within more asset classes in their portfolio, they want to keep track of 
the, their impact goals and impact performances. You can find the tool on the Tonic website. It's at tonic.com T100 Impact Portfolio Tool. You can download it by entering your information about uh, who you are and whether you would like to subscribe to Tonic Newsletter. Again, you can find the tool on the tonic.com website. If you just land on tonic.com, you can go on Knowledge Center and then on the Impact Tonic Impact Portfolio tool. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed this demo and let me know if you have any questions. You can always contact us at analyst at tonic.com. Analyst at tonic.com. Thank you very much. Goodbye.